Here's how you make a 2x2 two two inch picture in Canva just like the one we have here on the screen. First of all, if you haven't done so, create a Canva free account. After that, on Canva's homepage in the upper right corner, click on create a design. And then select custom size. Then before you actually put in the exact dimensions here, change from pixels to inches. And then enter 2 for width and 2 for height. 2 by 2 inches equals 51 by 51 millimeters. You could also insert that in millimeters of course, then instead of inches here, you would make sure to choose millimeters. And then simply enter 51 for the width and 51 for the height. As a Canva free user, it's very important that you set these dimensions from the very beginning, because you won't be able to resize your design later on, as this is a Canva Pro feature. So once you set the dimensions right, click here on create new design. Now it is time for you to upload your picture to Canva. You can do so by pressing here on uploads in the left toolbar and then click on upload files and then simply locate your picture on your computer and upload it. Alternatively, you can also simply drag and drop a picture directly into Canva. You can either drag it directly here into the uploads folder or even onto your design. In both cases, it will also automatically be saved here under uploads. Now, as you are making a 2x2 two two picture, chances are that you will need this for your passport or some other official document. With that said, one of the main requirements for these kind of images is that they always need to be on a white background. So in case your picture does not have a white background, in Canva, you do have the option to remove backgrounds. And this is exactly what I did with this picture here. On the first page, we have the original picture. And then on the second page, we do have the same picture, but the background here has been removed completely. Now, if you would like to remove the background in Canva, you can do that by clicking on the picture and then click on edit image in the top toolbar and then select background remover. However, it needs to be said that this is a Canva Pro feature only. So if you are on Canva free, this won't work. However, in the description of this video, you will find a link for a 30 day free trial of Canva Pro. So if you would like to use this feature, simply use the link that I provided in the description of this video and sign up for a free trial of Canva Pro. To download your picture, once you're happy with the result, simply click on share in the upper right corner then click on download and then for the file type here choose either PNG, JPEG or PDF print. For the best quality choose PDF print. If you don't want to have your image as a PDF though, I suggest you to use PNG. Once you made your decision, if you just have one page in your project, you can simply click here on download. As I have two pages here in my project, under select pages, I would make sure to only select the second page because I just want to download the picture where the background actually has been removed. So I would make sure to only take page two here. But if you just have one page in your project with one simple picture, then you obviously don't need to do that. So I'll click here on done. And then to finalize the process, I would simply click here on download. Now, I did mention before that you get the best quality for your image if you choose PDF print. However, if you don't want to have your image as a PDF though, but would still like to have a better quality than just downloading it as a regular PNG here, then I have a great hack for you that will tell you how to convert a PDF print document to a high quality PNG with a resolution of 300 dpi. To see how that works exactly, make sure to watch the next video on my channel.